Hey, what's happening everyone? This is Yummy Mash here, and I thought I would finally begin myself a Minecraft series again because it's been such a long time. I used to upload Minecraft more or less daily uh, about a year, a year and a half ago, and I kind of stopped. I kind of started doing Minecraft with friends. I did Minecraft with um, my best friend at the time, well, my best friend, Shane, and I did Minecraft with uh, Markiplier, but I've never done Minecraft well, I have done Minecraft by myself, but I've never done something a little different. So what I'm going to do is we're going to do a Minecraft series, but it's going to be basically a hardcore survival mode where it's going to be more or less if I die once, it's game over. So I'm going to have to do everything I can to survive. And it's going to make it a little more in intense, I would say, especially when we go mining and stuff. So I'm going to call this Yummy Mashland. I don't know, I couldn't think of a really good name for it, but that'll do. Anyway, um, I am really glad to be playing Minecraft again. I've always had a lot of fun playing Minecraft. I've uh, got myself my nice stacks texture pack. So let's start off uh, by mining some wood then. Um, I, I played this game ever since the, I think, the beta stage for it. Uh, really long time ago I saw um, Nana's uh, post a video on Minecraft and then I watched a whole series by another YouTuber called uh, X or David R I think 64 YouTube or something and that was his YouTube name something like that and I watched his entire Minecraft Let's Play and I had a lot of fun watching it and ever since then I think it's safe to say and we'd all agree that the a lot and I mean a lot of YouTubers have done Minecraft videos or make Minecraft videos and that's because Really, the reason why it hasn't really become outdated is because of all the mods for the for the game, all the mods, the texture packs, and then even the online things like you know we've had the Hunger Games and um, all the little fun games they can do online. Like there's a game where you um you play, um, it's basically one v one. You have shovels and you try and shovel the ground underneath your opponent, and they fall in the lava and die. It's such a fun little game. But yeah, um, I've always always enjoyed Minecraft. We'll just mine out this tree, I suppose. And and the thing I really like about this game is firstly it's a sandbox game so you can do whatever you want whenever you want more or less uh, as long as you don't go past the uh, boundaries of the game in terms of the laws and stuff but secondly um i like that there it's different every time you spawn in you get a different world every single time and anything can really happen oh my god that, those four extras are actually pretty useful let me kill this pig i mean actually, i may as well make a sword if i want to kill this pig so let's plop this down and um, I'm sorry if my mouse is a little bit loud, because it really is. Uh, I, I could have done that a different way, honestly. Uh, so yeah, let's make a sword, and I'm gonna kill this pig real quick. And we'll need we'll need a pickaxe too, actually. Why my right click button isn't working? Usually I just right click it, I'll drop half the blocks, but that's not working for me anymore. Very weird. Okay, um, that's in my inventory. Let's kill this pig. Where is it, piggy? Come here, it's, it's Bambi. Is it Bambi? No, it's not Bambi, it's Babe. It's Babe. Bambi's the, the deer, I think. Uh, I watched that a long time. There's a pig in a tree. I watched that a long time ago. Very, very sad show, I have to say. Die, pig. Not today. Okay, let's mine this up. Um, Actually, we'll, we'll go in the tree, I suppose, if we can reach the fudging thing. Piggy! Piggy! Damn, he's too high up. Damn you, babe! How could you? All right, you know we should make an axe, really. That'll um, save us a lot of time with uh, cutting trees and mining back at my crafting table, and that should be enough for now. Uh, we're gonna try and upgrade to uh, stone, and then hopefully iron. But really, what we need to find more than anything is coal, because obviously the first day uh, when it ends, it's gonna become night time, and when night time arrives. Creatures spawn in the dark, so there'll be monsters trying to kill me. And uh, this is more or less a uh, just me giving you information for people who haven't really seen Minecraft before, which I'm sure quite a few people haven't seen Minecraft. Even the most popular games haven't been seen by some people. So I thought I'd let you know that. So you know, currently it's daytime. It's going to be nighttime probably. And where's the sun? It's almost halfway in the sky. I'd say maybe four minutes. Maybe not even that. Um, around then and then it'll, it'll become night time and then I'm gonna have to really build myself a house before then or oh, a sheep that means I can get to beds I thought that sheep was floating then so we need to get three wool so that's three pigs let's get some chicken breasts mm -mm -mm. some feathers for my uh, future arrows oh my god there's so many this is the best spawn ever oh my god don't tell me I've already oh my god coal holy 
damn it, guys, this is the greatest map I've spawned into in a long time. Usually I'll spawn into things like forests or islands or some bullshit, or I'll spawn into a place with barely any trees or too many trees, and then you won't find a cave or anything for ages or coal. But look at this, I found coal almost instantly. I found a ton of animals for food and for, sh for, for wool, for beds. And really, this this is... I could not ask for a better... Sp ha! Oh, oh god! No! 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 Oh my god, okay, he did like maybe half a hat. He didn't really do anything. I think he blew up the iron though, which is a massive shame because I really wanted to farm that. Okay, guys, there's a cave there. We do not want to go down there just yet. Have I got any? I got some cobblestone. Actually, oh, I don't know what to do right here. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna mine this and turn it into like a staircase. Oh god, there's a bat! Fuck off, bat! I I never knew bats were in this game. This is new. These things weren't in the game when I used to play back in the back in the good old days. I sound like an old man right now. Back in my days, there were never bats in Minecraft. The only creatures were duck, sheep, and pigs. Oh, and camels. Can't forget camels. And yeah, so the only enemies were skeletons, spiders, creepers, and zombies. But now you have all this extra shit. Oh, and slimes, I suppose. Um, alright. Uh, I got enough cobblestone. I'm gonna craft myself some more shiz. I hear a noise. I really hope that's not an enemy. That would suck. So this is gonna allow me to... Um, I'll put that one there. Allow me to farm up the iron that I saw, and then we'll use, we'll you know, keep the wooden sword there. We'll leave it like that. So, this, this is looking quite good. What's that noise? Hello? Okay, there's the iron. Give me, give me, give me one. Oh, one more. Oh, shit. I wish that creeper didn't. Hey, pig! Unlucky for you that you fell into my little trap. Alright, I don't really want to go down there just yet simply because it will be a death trap and I will die. So, um, just basically parkouring my way out of this place. Um, jump, there we go. And we can go through the sandy area. Oh, nice little, little, uh, lake right there. So let's kill some more pigs. Really, we want to, um, farm this for all it's worth while we can. I think I really do need to make a, uh, I wonder what the bats drop. I am kind of curious. We don't really need sheep anymore. Uh, I, I do need to make a house around about now. So I'm thinking we can make the house. I don't want to make it by all these animals because they will drive me crazy at night time. So let's walk a little bit. We'll go near the far, the frost forest kingdom. That should be perfect. Um, for a first house, I think here should be just fine. And I think 50 should be enough wood to build it. We'll make a little hut. We won't make anything too special. Uh, okay, I need to uh, pick this back up. I'm I'm a massive. Um, God damn it! I get really OCD if um, things aren't perfect. So I'll make this six like that. There we go. This is looking good. Looking very good indeed. We'll have the door here. So you know, I'm, I may need more wood actually. <laughs> I need wood. <laughs> Got wood, good sir. No, I need it. I need to get to wood. Ah, fudge cakes. Let's break that. There we go. I'll pick you up in a bit. Okay, one more like this. Now, even as it is, it's not going to be perfectly safe, but it's more safe than if I didn't build it at all, you know? Oh, man. Have I got no more wood? This is sucks. Okay, so let's... I'm pretty sure these trees are different. Why is there lava there? That sucks that there's lava right next to my wooden house. But I won't complain because I don't know how the hell... Nothing's going to happen that's going to cause my house to go on fire from the lava. It's not like there's a volcano. They need a volcano in this game. That'd be brilliant. Volcanoes, tsunamis from the ocean, you know, waves. That's a really stupid idea. Okay, man. If that dirt block wasn't there and I fell into the lava, I would have been pissed. So since this is um, going to be a hardcore survival mode, where when I die, the game's over, I will, in fact, well, if I die, this series is over. So th there's no question as to how long this is going to last, honestly, guys. This could literally last two, three episodes. It could last maybe ten. It could. I, I really don't know. It depends how well I do and if I can survive that long. Anyway, 
Um, I, I'll just, isn't, there's no point really putting much effort into this right now. It really is survival measures at the moment. So I'll craft a door. Oh, gosh, you know, oh no, I need to uh, get my crafting table on the floor. There's my crafting table. I thought I lost it right then. Nope. You go in the corner, crafting table. So let's make a door with my supremely loud mouse. You all enjoying that? I thought so. Okay, let's place this down. Boom. Oh, no, I'm, I'm ready OCD. I placed it on the inside like that, and that's a big problem. Okay, let's place it. There we go. That's more like it. Um, so, I have sticks. I have coal. So I'll make a few torches right there. And we're going to place these torches on the, you know, the outside area, I suppose. Like that. So things don't spawn directly in front of me. I'll pick those up after night anyway. There's a torch. Um, I suppose we can make a bed right now. That would be quite useful, I would imagine. So is it three down there and then three here? I think that's the wrong order. There we go. There's a bed. And I'll place the bed right. Stupid grass. There's my bed. Right next to the crafting table. It gives me a little headrest, I suppose. Uh, a furnace is always useful. Especially when I go off adventuring and I need to smell the iron and the diamond I pick up. So let's get that on the go. Do I need to cook anything? I can cook my meat, actually. So we'll do that right now. So really, what I'm going to do is, not long after this, and I think I'll put one more call in there just in case, uh, what I'm going to do after this is, uh, once I survive the first night, I have my tea by the way, hmm. once I survive the first night, I'm going to go down into the depths of the earth, and we are going to look for rarer minerals, and uh, this is where the series could end quite drastically and quite quickly. Um, I think it's getting dark actually, yes it is, it's turning to night time, this means enemies will spawn. Mmm, look at that sunset right there, beautiful. Just beautiful, there's the moon. So, um, I suppose we'll place one torch here as well. So, hopefully nothing gets too close to the, my house, I would hope. Um, <clears throat> I do need to have a bite to eat. So, you may back to full food meter. I have a sword anyway, let's uh, a little peek outside. Hello? No monsters just yet. I'm going to double check. I mean, even though a, a creeper did spawn, I do want to change the difficulty to hard. I want this to be the most hardest it can be. So there we go. I should have done that right at the beginning, honestly. But now it's on hard. <clears throat> so really, I'm trying to make this as difficult for myself as possible by giving myself only one life and then increasing the difficulty. Now, uh, I know a lot of people play this game more for the building aspect and I don't mind building things and I will build a house if I do get the time and I will build oh there's a skeleton so creatures have spawned now let's get back inside I mean it's so silly mm. hopefully I can sleep I will build things if necessary that was a zombie <laughs>